I'm Chang, Chief Engineer for Dragon Group China. Today we are in Chandong Province, in Tai'an City, directly in the factory of the Puhui T machines, the revolving VGA railroad stations. And today we are going to present a series of tutorials of how to use each single machine. We are going to present three of the Puhui T series. And we hope uh, you enjoy these tutorials. We are going to go from the beginning, how to turn off the on of the machine, take out the chips, revolve the chips, or work with them, and uh, to put them back in the board. We hope you enjoy these tutorials and visit us at www.puhuiti.com. Any question, please write to us at info at puhuiti.com. By DGC Media, the machine with the same name, the Puhuiti A62++. The A62++ features a preheating area of 120 times 120 millimeters, an infrared beam that goes from 20 to 45 millimeters. You can get the 45 millimeters with the extension lenses. You are going to get two extension lenses plus the normal extension lens, normal lens that comes with the machine. Here we are going to work in a SMT chip to replace it in a notebook motherboard. This machine again do all the chips from 20 to 35 millimeters and 45 with the extension lens. The temperature we are using here are 147, 260, and 300 for the iron, 147, 150 for the preheating ceramic plate, 260 we are going to use in the infrared, and we are going to use the soldering iron in 300. This is a soldering iron, the 907 class, a medium iron, which is similar to the ones in the 936 station, soldering iron station. Also in the 939 Dragon Group China Digital Station, the length of the iron is similar, it's a 907 middle class and here we are working to remove this SMT from the laptop board and we are going to do the replace, the chip is removed now we are cooling it a little bit and we have our chip and we are going to rework it
that is going to proceed now. to replace the chip in the motherboard this is an SMT work that we are showing to you with the Puhuiti A62++ the middle class machine with an area of 120 x 120 in preheating infrared beam from 20 millimeters to 45 You see the area, very important, between the infrared and the chip is around 30 millimeters. So remember the recommended distance from the chip, from the board to the infrared beam is 25 to 30 millimeters. That's the perfect distance you have. Remember that if you have chips around the one you are working with, use the insulation tape. So you don't get problems with other chips around the one you are working with. So here we are working this SMT in a laptop motherboard with this Puhui T A62. Again, we are working with 150 in the preheating, 260 in the infrared, and 300 in the iron. And here is the work. It is the job done. You will replace your SMT from your laptop motherboard. And again, any question, any information you need, please write to us at info at Uit.com. This is a presentation by www.dragongroupchina.com for you by DGC Media and very soon, like 25 to 30 days, we have a special machine that is designed to repair Xbox boards. So this machine can make it but we are working on it and in around 30 to 40 days, uh, today is um, April the 1st, so around May, we have already the Puhui T999 that will be specifically for Xbox motherboards. And this was your tutorial about the T862++. Stay tuned for more tutorials. We are going to have also the T878, also the IC heaters, the reflow ovens. And thank you for watching.